Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is LibArchive Vulnerabilities. If you're not a Linux user or a programmer, you may not have heard of LibArchive, but this is a library for archive decompression and compression. Basically, it's a Linux library that can uh, be used to decompress archive files, like RAR and 7-zip files. Well, today, Talos Security, a Cisco research team, released information about three serious vulnerabilities in LibArchive. I won't describe them in detail, but long story short, if a bad guy can get you to handle a specially crafted archive using a product that uses libarchive, he could exploit these vulnerabilities to execute code on your system, which is a pretty big deal. Now, of course, if you're a Linux user, you might have libarchive and you need to update your Linux distro. But even if you're not a Linux user and you haven't heard of libarchive, do know this is a component in many Linux-based security appliances or network appliances or even Linux-based software. So if you have any network appliances out there that might use Linux, you probably want to look for updates that might fix this libarchive vulnerability. By the way, do know WatchGuard Fireboxes do use a vulnerable version of libarchive, but our engineers have already patched this internally, so we should have a fireware update soon that fixes this vulnerability. In any case, whether or not you use Linux, if you have network security gear, you might want to look for updates that could fix this. And of course, check out the Talos Group's research for more information. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.